The purpose of the Civility Project is to promote respectful, kind, and effective communication between fellow members of the community. In order to promote this, there are 12 essential tools of civility. The first tool of civility is to pay attention. In the month of January, focusing and giving your full attention to others will increase your effectiveness in communicating. For February, listening is a key tool. When you listen, you show others you are interested and care about what they are saying. During March, it is important to be aware before you share. Whether you are sharing information with others or digitally, you should think about what your thoughts say about you. Another key tool of civility is to accept and give praise. In April, remember to thank others for praise you receive, but also to reward with them with equal admiration. In May, speaking kindly is crucial to maintain civility. When communicating with others, kindness can make the difference. To take ownership is an important part of civility and communication. For the month of June, owning your opinions and representing your ideas is a necessity. Including others is a vital tool of civility. Remember to not only include others, but their thoughts and opinions as well for the month of July. As you discuss your opinions and others in August, don't forget to assert yourself. Make sure you are clearly understood when talking on your thoughts and ideas. Throughout September, being responsible is the tool to use. Take initiative, make smart choices, and lead the way to demonstrate responsibility. Remember to respect others in October. Regard others' thoughts and opinions with politeness and courtesy to show your respect for them. In addition to kindness, caring is key for November. Take the extra step to care for others by showing positivity, optimism, and friendliness. To round off the year and the tools of civility, you should always think the best. An optimistic attitude can make the difference when working with others. To effectively and civilly communicate, you should use all of the components of the tools of civility. Efficiently combining these tools in everyday life will improve your communication and the communities.